this is currently what's happening. <laughs> Out of you. Yeah. You're so sweet. Where should I get your... Like this kid had a road cone, a big orange road cone, holding it to his mouth and screaming. <laughs> Sit here, waiting for my teachers to come out so I can go in this ginormous school right here. Your hair looks fantastic today. Yeah. This is currently what's happening. <laughs> I'm trying to remove my gel nails. Um, I don't want to show you guys my face because I look horrendous, but. I saw on YouTube this is what you have to do. I have a cotton ball with acetone underneath the foils and I have to let it sit for 10 to 15 minutes and then I scrape it off with this stick here. Um, I'm going to get them done again but I don't want to get them done again until right before we leave for vacation. So I'll let you guys see them when I'm done. Okay, it's been about 12 minutes. Nothing happened. Oh, that's scraping off now. Hey guys, you are finally seeing my face for the first time today. <gasps> Did you just wake up? Yeah. Uh, Dawson just woke up from his morning snooze. And it's almost time to go get Gavin, so I'm going to get his diaper changed and get him ready to go. We're going to go pick Gavin up, and then I think we're going to make a run to the store and maybe get some lunch. Um, I need to get some stuff for dinner tonight. Uh, Britt and the kids and I are going to go to Family Fit Night tonight, which is a group of local people that get together for this. It's free. It's a free clinic, and you work, just work out for an hour. So we're going to go do that. I think that's at 6.30 tonight, and I'm super excited about that because I need to get my beach body for the beach because we're leaving in less than two weeks to go to Florida. And I'm super excited. Um, I still need to buy a few things. Like I need to get a bathing suit still. Which I think I might order off of wine. Because I found one I really liked. I'm coming. I'm trying to get the house picked up real quick. I found one that I really liked online. So I'm probably going to order that one. And just hope that it fits. Alright, we're on the road. Going to pick up Gab. And then probably run to the store. It's a really nice day. Uh, it's kind of cloudy but it feels really good outside. It's probably 60 degrees already and it's only uh, almost 11. So that's good. Um, if the weather stays nice maybe we'll take the boys and Copper to the park. That'll be fun. I have a big sandwich. And I'm probably going to slap him from its me and Gab just got some lunch from Jimmy John's. We both said it. This is the first time we've ever been here. How do you like it? I'm gonna try a bite. Thumbs up. Good. We parked here so that we can watch these people over way over there build Kroger. We're getting a super Kroger. A super big Kroger. Sam. Oh, there's some hay. What are you doing sitting up front, mister? 
He had to sit up front with mom to eat a sandwich. Didn't you? Yep. So now we're at Goodwill and we're gonna go in and see if we can find some summer clothes. Uh, just excuse me. Really? Hey guys, we just got home. Uh, the baby is asleep in his car seat, so I'm gonna do this real quick. I wanna show you what I got at Goodwill. Um, I got a lot of cute stuff, uh, mostly shirts for our trip to Florida. Um, I didn't get a chance to look for anything for the boys because Dawson started crying, so I had to get out of there as quickly as I could. Luckily, I had a chance to try all this on, and it does fit. Um, I was very disappointed when I found out what size shorts I wear. When I got pregnant with Dawson, I was wearing a size 6. Now I wear a size 11, 12. That's why we're going to family fit night tonight. Anyway, here is the one pair of shorts I got. They fit really nice. Um, they aren't see-through. I have on like dark colored underwear right now and I could not see the underwear through the shorts. So I really like that. And they don't, you know, dig into my sides or anything. Uh, so let's get to the shirt. Um, this shirt here is black and white with some designs on it. And it's loose fitting so my gut doesn't show. Here is a, I don't know if this is navy blue or black, but it's white stripe, white with stripes. Just a regular, regular old tee. Cute. And it's got these little like buttons on the sleeve. Oh, this is probably my favorite. I picked this up not thinking it was going to fit and not thinking that I was going to like it. This is a workout shirt and it's got a built-in bra and the back is like this, part goes over your shoulders and I love it. I'm going to wear it tonight as soon as I get it washed. I love it. It's got um, pinkish maroon little dots and black and white and it's so silky smooth and it doesn't even look like it's been worn. So that's always a good thing. Here comes Gavin, he's in trouble. It's fine. Uh, here's a little shirt from Old Navy. Doesn't look like it's been worn. It says, live, laugh, learn, love. And it looks really, really orange on the camera right now, but it's actually kind of pink. Like, like a pinkish orange, like a coral. But it looks really orange on the camera. Oh, I love this shirt too. Once again, I don't think this has like ever been worn. It's got these little frillies by the button. It's like a tannish gray color and it's got the three quarter sleeves. They don't quite go down to my elbow. It's very soft. Yeah, from Morona. I think that might be a Target brand. Oh, I really like this one too. I love shirts like this that have a built-in bra because I hate it, hate it, hate it when I have to wear a tank and my bra shows. Like that's one of my pet peeves. I just think that that doesn't look very classy and I don't think that anybody should see your bra. But um, yeah, it's very cute. The back looks like that. And a lot of times when you go to thrift stores and you find shirts like this with like kind of like a mesh, these will be ripped and torn but this one I checked it over and over and it is not ripped or torn and it's long enough to cover my torso and I have an extra long torso you're supposed to be in timeout and I got this little gray tank it's got braided spaghetti straps very cute um, this one does not have a built-in bra, but I don't plan on wearing this by itself. I plan on having like a little uh, sweater to go over it. And it's really long. It's like my favorite thing about it. I love long shirts because I hate it when I move and my belly comes plopping out. It's embarrassing. And this is the last thing. Just a black tank with gold sequins. 
very, very cute. It looks see-through in the back, kind of there. You can see the light coming through. But in the front, it's not really see-through. I usually wear a cami with almost every shirt I wear, but today I did not wear a cami, and I put this shirt on and you couldn't see my bra or anything. So I really like that, and it's long. So that concludes our little Goodwill haul. Oh, and just in case anyone wants to know, I spent $31, which I feel is a little much. Um, Goodwill, um, our Goodwill anyway, has raised the prices drastically. Um, the shirts were, what the heck is that? Apparently something I bought was $9. $9. I don't know. That's weird. Uh, but these shirts ranged from $3.99 to $4.49. I think that's a little much. I don't think that you should pay over $2 for a used shirt. That's just me but it's better than going to the store and paying full price, I assume. But um, one thing, when you go to Goodwill, don't buy anything from Walmart, that faded glory. Do not buy anything from Walmart because you could probably go to Walmart and buy that exact same thing, brand new, never been worn for the same price. And now I need to figure out why this, why I was charged an extra $9. Gavin's having a pretty hard time right now. We're just struggling with some respect issues. There's been a lot of talking back and a lot of sass coming out of that one. And that's, that's, that's not how this works. That doesn't work for me. Um, his dad is usually the one that, um, he's a lot more disciplinary than I am. Um, that probably has a lot to do with the way I was raised, but that doesn't mean that he can disrespect me, so he's going down for a nap, and Gavin doesn't usually take naps, but I think he is in desperate need of one. If someone woke up in a little bit of a better mood, still kind of grumpy. So we're just sitting here, I am responding to comments. And watching vlogs, there's David. Hi, David. And I'm still having, I'm still having the same issue with replying to your guys's sweet comments. Um, I still can't see if or when or what I replied. So if I happen to reply to your comment twice, I'm sorry. Or if I miss yours, I'm sorry. I probably thought that I already re replied to it. I'm in the process of trying to figure out how to fix that little issue. Sorry about that. So I got all my new shirts washed. They're hanging up and drying. Of course, there's always one out of the bunch that you ruined the first time you washed that. I think this one shrunk in the wash. It got a little bit shorter, I think. And I didn't even dry it, so I don't know what the deal is there. One of these days, I'll learn how to do laundry correctly. We're off to family fit night. Who's excited? Me. I don't know how all this Everybody is going to play out. Excited to put their hand up. I hope Britt's the only man there, and we're doing yoga poses. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll sit over there with the baby. Oh my. But honey, I thought you were training for the Broken Skull Challenge. No. Not yet. Maybe next year. <laughs> so we just got done with Family Fit Camp. If you can't tell, my face is bright red. <sighs> Did you have fun? It was alright. You feel good right now? Uh, I had sure. great fun there. I feel really good. Like, you know that energy burst that you get right after you work out? It feels good. I'm gonna go back, and so are you. 
He tried sitting on the sidelines with the baby. He's like, I'll just wait here, you know? I'm just gonna scope out everything. I and just need Sit to... here and watch you work out. And I was like, <laughs> oh no. Oh no, sir. You are going to work out. I wanted out with to us. just ease into it. You e said. I just wanted to check everything out, see how everything was going, and make sure that the baby wasn't like gonna freak out or not like the noise or kids running around or anything else. I was just trying to ease into it. Dawson was so cute the whole time. <laughs> he, I had him in his little car seat sitting right next to me, and he was laughing and giggling and like his little cute screams that he does. He didn't cry one time, did he? No. He was just watching me doing my excruciating and, and workout. I, and, uh, like some of it was super hard. Some of it I couldn't do. Because I tried and it, that, that chair thing where you had to put your feet in and out of the chair and then side to side and up and once down. Once I figured out exactly, oh my like God. I, it took me a minute to get it down and once I got it down I was able to do it really fast and then it wore my butt out. I, I, I don't even think I did it one time. I, didn't, I don't think I did it all the way through it even one time. <laughs> crazy y'all but we're gonna keep going because I mean it wasn't so bad that like I couldn't walk out of there I probably could have done a little bit more but it was just enough I think <laughs> and Gavin had fun playing except yeah. there was this one kid there that just screamed the whole time and I had to keep making sure it wasn't Gavin no Gavin wouldn't scream like that like this kid had a road cone a big orange road cone holding it to his mouth and screaming at it, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> it was kind of ridiculous but we had a good time and i enjoyed it hey guys we're home now dawson's happy he's on his little blankie can we say hello <gasps> say hello oh you were so good at fit camp I'm proud of you yeah you're so sweet. You officially get your... You were good, too. They had a bunch of kids there, and Kevin was running around playing. Basketball. Hey, I thought I asked you to get this room cleaned up. Ugh. So anyway, we're going to get ready to end the vlog, but I wanted to show you guys what came in the mail today. I got my Vanity Planet and I'm gonna use it tonight before bed. All right guys, we're gonna get ready for bed. So, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the red subscribe button below. Check us out on social media. We got Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. And Facebook. We will see you all tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Happy retirement, Peyton Manning.